Hi, I'm Kay Jackowitz. I'm a FIFA referee from Australia. I've been on the FIFA list since 2011 and on the AFC Elite list since 2013. Well, this will be my second World Cup, but the feeling is, is no different. Um, to be selected for the Women's World Cup, Australia, New Zealand, is a, is a really proud feeling and I, I'm really honoured to, to represent my country and AFC. Having the World Cup in, in my home country is um, it's an incredible feeling um, to, to show the world what Australian football can, can produce. Um, and also what I'm really excited by is the, the legacy that the game, that the, the tournament will have on, on football in, in our country, um, including New Zealand as well. Um, the growth of the game is, is getting bigger every year and especially women's football uh, capitalising on that growth um, really to, to cement that as one of the, the highest participating sports in, in the country. Um, yeah, it's, it's a really special feeling. Well, I was a player, started as a player from a very young age and uh, the natural progression was to go into refereeing as I was always around my, my junior football club, helping around the club and uh, wanting to earn some pocket money. Um, but then as I get older, I was able to um, you know, experience higher level sort of football and go into representative football and then be, um, go to representative tournaments and it just basically snowballed from there. So the doors just continue to open. I continually put in more work at every level that um, I had to step up to and, and here I am, a 25 year journey expanded my, most of my life and my entire adult life. So yeah, football, I would say, is oh, being a referee is, is, is part of my identity and who I am now. As elite match officials, preparation is crucial. AFC provides many development opportunities, um, whether that's through seminars um, and with on-field training and in-the-classroom training. We've done online, online training, but also the many tournaments that we get selected to and appointed to. Each one provides a different, I guess, aspect and, and learning experience through different styles of football. So AFC has been, in, been crucial to the development pathway for, for, I would say, all match officials involved in the Women's World Cup. Our preparation starts long before we even enter the field of play. Um, physically, that means we're, we're training daily um, you know, for, for a number of training cycles in the lead up to be at our peak performance when we get to or arrive at the tournament. Mentally prepared is no different. Um, we need to ensure that we're you know, watching football, um, taking in the different styles of play. Um, I think FIFA like to call it you know, eat football, but I also then take a more, a different approach, and that is to, to have a clear and calm mind when I'm entering into these tournaments um, and not to put too much pressure on myself because the expectation is these matches will be high pressure. So if the mind is calm and clear, the decision-making process is much easier so I can just call what I see. Well, I recently read an article from one of the, the match officials that went to World Cup and, and she said, the door is well and truly open now. And I 100% agree with that. The, the success of the female match officials in Qatar really showed the world the quality of, of female match officials and the direction in which they're going. The future is so exciting. And I really look forward to many other match officials following in the footsteps of Yoshimi and, and Stephanie for part. Um, it's, uh, it's an exciting new world in football. No journey is the same. Your journey may look different to someone else's journey, but where you want to go is, is, is what it, you are defined by. So work hard. There's, there's, no, there's no escaping that. Um, but it, enjoy, enjoy the process, enjoy the ride. It is a demanding career and, and, and journey along the way. You'll have some really high highs and some and pretty low lows. But if you know what you're doing it for, and, and which is the love of the game for me, um, it, it's, it's, a pretty, it's a pretty fun ride. And I wouldn't change my journey um, one, one bit. It, it shaped the person I am 
and um, I'm really fortunate to live the life that, and, the op and have the opportunities that's been provided to me.